I am Caitlin McFadden. I am a high school math teacher and I have been here for three years. This is my ninth year teaching. Um, I teach pre-algebra and algebra two in addition to doing the after school program for our kids who need help after school. My job looks a lot different based off of which course I'm currently teaching at the moment. In pre-algebra, it's a lot more of me working with individual students because they're all at a very different place and trying to help them get all to the same place while meeting them where they're at right now. In Algebra 2, it's a little more student-centered because they're juniors and sophomores for the most part, and they have a lot more knowledge of the content already, so it's a matter of helping them develop those skills more than they already are. Um, and it's a lot more of group work and them helping each other figure it out as well, and I'm more of a facilitator. Right now, Algebra 2 is working on something called logarithms, which are used a lot in things like pH levels and exponential functions that have really high values or really small values. And pre-algebra is working on polynomials, so they're getting a lot of practice with variables and exponents and multiplying them together and adding them together. My favorite part about working in Eudora is it kind of has two parts. The first part is the people who I get to work with. Uh, I really love the people and the staff who surround me every day and the students are just amazing as well. Um, it's just a really easy job to have fun coming to every day. The most rewarding part about being an educator to me is when students have been struggling with something a lot and they finally just get it because math can be a really big struggle for a lot of kids. And so helping them through that sort of aha moment is my favorite thing about teaching because it's the most rewarding to me because it means I've done my job. And it just is amazing to see the confidence that that gives them as well. For example, last week I had a kid who's just missed a ton of school and it's just been really hard for them to catch up. They're sort of out of their rhythm and everything and they were able to come in and get that lesson and they left here, they were smiling, they were happy, they were explaining it to their friends and they just felt so confident because they knew how to do it and their friends didn't and so they got to kind of become the teacher for a moment and that's just, that is the most rewarding part of my job. The hardest part of my job is motivating people who are not so excited to be in math class. Uh, to me, the easiest way is to make it a competition. They absolutely love it and it kind of forces them to try because they don't want to lose to the people next to them. Um, and then just kind of allowing them to take a deep breath if they need to. And we're not going to understand every lesson every day fully. There are going to be some lessons we have to go back to. And just giving them multiple chances to learn something is usually all that my kids need to really get it. One of my favorite things that I do every year that tends to be one of my favorite parts of the year is uh, Jim Bernard and I are both Algebra 2 teachers, so every year we have a factoring championship with our Algebra 2 students, and my students compete within my classes, and our top four compete against his top four during Cardinal Advisory, and they have so much fun with it because they're trying to win for our class so that my classes can be better than his classes, and they have such a fun time with it, and being able to combine classes like that isn't something that I've always been able to do teaching in other districts. And so it's just really fun to be able to see all of the kids who are in that class at Eudora High coming together to compete against each other. And it really motivates even the kids who don't normally like to do math. It kind of makes it a little more, there's a little bit more at stake for them. One of the things I've loved most about teaching specifically in Eudora since I've gotten here is the amount of support every staff member has. We are truly all working together for all students. And I know that when my students leave my room, there are other people who are also going to see them during the day who are going to catch them as well, even if maybe my class went fine and other classes it goes badly for them. Um, I also know that I can lean on any other teacher that I need to. I always have people I can go to to ask questions, to give ideas and get feedback from and kind of collaborate with and be able to do activities that don't just go through my classes but go through other classes as well and that other teachers are willing to work with me to do that too. So I truly feel like we have the best students and the best teachers here in Eudora.